I started watching highlights of Michael Penix as a righty, and I'm like, hold up, wait a minute. Is that prime Tom Brady right there? Look at that dart. That's an absolute dime. It's crazy how right-hand dominant we are as a society where you watch left-handed Michael Penix Jr. highlights and you're like, how on earth did the Falcons think to take this guy at eight? And then you watch him as a righty and you're like, hold up. He's looking a little Mahomey. And there's something about him wearing purple. Like, watch him juke out this defender right here. He jukes out this defender in purple. I'm like, oh my God, that's Lamar Jackson. That's the MVP of this league. And I'm obviously being hyperbolic here when I say all of this stuff. But there is something about watching him as a righty. Like, we are right-hand biased as a society. We think people who are right-handed are just better at things, and that's not necessarily true. Like, it really does beg the question, if Michael Penix Jr. was a righty, is he a consensus, no-brainer, top-five pick? And look, say what you will about him, I'm rooting for this guy. He penned a letter to every single NFL GM saying, look, I know that you have injury concerns about me, but if you take an MRI of my body, the only one that matters is taking an EKG of my heart because you'll find that there's a dog in there. I don't care if my quarterback's a lefty or a righty. I just want him to be a dog.